everybody. Uh, it's been a while since I have uh, created a flipped video, and so I'm super excited to get back to these. Uh, so we have been studying about le electricity, and um, so we're going to continue our study on electricity, and you'll notice this time uh, I've given you a, a guided question sheet uh, for your notes. I don't want you to copy down everything on the board. What I do want you to do, however, is answer those questions within your notes. Please make sure you restate the question uh, within your answer as you do that. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. So we are all fascinated by electricity. Electricity is everywhere. We have learned that last week when we went on our little scavenger hunt throughout the school. Uh, so I've just drawn a couple of examples that you can see up here where we find electricity and how difficult it would be to live without electricity. So let's go ahead and define what is electricity. Well, electricity is a type of energy, which we've studied energy being light, sound, uh, heat. Uh, there's an energy of motion. Uh, and so we're just looking at the electrical side of energy that can be that can build up in one place or flow from one place to another. So I've underlined the word build up and flow because that gives us our two types of electricity that we're going to be looking at in this video. So what are those two types? Well, as I see it, one of them causes a traffic jam and we've all been a part of a traffic jam. And the other one is where traffic is wonderful, it's moving uh, at, it, at, its, at the rate it's supposed to, uh, it is moving smoothly. And so um, those uh, are just two analogies that you can make and compare the two types of electricity uh, to traffic. So what are the actual names of those two types? So let's discuss that. So let's look at the buildup, the buildup of electricity. Well, the buildup of electricity is actually called static electricity. And that's when you see and you try, especially in the wintertime when you're putting on your clothes and your hair starts standing out. I know I have several kids, several of my, my kids that uh, their hair does that. Uh, so static electricity is a buildup of elect electricity. It doesn't last very long and it's caused from friction some type of rubbing together that has made those electrons uh, get agitated and create that electricity. So you can see here, I've kind of drawn a wall. Let me fix it where you can see it a little better. There we go. Um, you, I've kind of drawn a wall and you can see that this is our traffic jam. This is a where there's something stopping that electricity from actually flowing, which leads us into our next type of electricity, which is actually called current electricity. And current electricity obviously lasts longer. Um, and these we find a lot of times in our appliances at home. Uh, we find in lamps, we find in microwaves, ovens. That is our current electricity. And a lot of, most of the time they have some type of switch something to turn it on whether it's a button or a switch uh, or a knob that turns on the electricity and it keeps it current and you can see i have my electrons here and they're flowing in a nice little neat pattern so this video was a real quick video over the two types of electricity we have static electricity and current electricity